Hi YouTube, this is a video tutorial on how to install Docker Community Engine on Ubuntu on uh, in GCP. So we're going to be using the Docker image that's available in the GCP marketplace. If you look in the description of this video, you'll see the, the different versions that are available and the link that takes you directly to this. So what you want to do is simply click on launch and choose what uh, VM size you want so I'm just going to use all the default options just for this so you can choose your name what location uh, machine type this size leave as default allow I'm going to allow port 22 open and you just hit deploy and that will go off it will build a fresh Ubuntu server with the docker community engine installed and then you simply log in and you're pretty much ready to go so I'm just going to let that run. I'm just going to pause the video. Okay, that's finished now. So that's deployed the server. So what I like to do normally now is I like to just log into the uh, GCP console and just check that the VM has, has fully booted up because within GCP it doesn't tell you if the VM is fully up and running. So I just like to click on the VM and look at the serial port console and this will show you any boot up messages so that looks like it has finished booting up so we're going to connect using uh, SH, SSH you can use PuTTY if you want to just log in but I'm just going to use GCP's default SH connection so wait for that okay we're logged in now so you're pretty much ready to go so what I'm gonna do just as a little test I'm gonna install the hello world image pull it down from the uh, docker hub so run that and that has pulled down the hello world image from the docker hub which means it's, it's ready to go so you can go ahead now and start building your uh, docker containers so if you've got any questions or any issues that you've had, just leave a comment below and I'll do my best to answer. And if this video has helped you uh, build in your, your Docker VM, please give this video a like or a subscription. I'd, uh, I'd really appreciate it. Thanks very much.